Hey guys, how's it going today? Hope everybody's having a fantastic day. I'm getting ready to do this reading for my soul family. And guys, if you're interested in a reading, just click on the description below the video and let's go. Please like and subscribe, guys, if you if you watch my channel. It really helps me a lot. Thank you. All right, here we go. All right, a lot of you, and this isn't going to come as a surprise, you're needing peace and quiet, guys. You need some peace. You need some rest. You need to nurture yourselves, okay, and love yourselves, all right? I'm seeing some defensiveness here regarding something who that's going on or someone doing something sneaky okay and along with this i see good news here i see good news you're moving into new water you're going to be receiving this good news shortly and it's going to be something that's going to make your cup run over with joy and happiness guys okay whatever this is it's a wish fulfillment for you and it's going to be your victory okay um it could be financial i see you guys a lot of you are working your asses off okay you're working hard um but the feeling is it's never enough okay and i'm seeing single moms out there you know having to work hard and juggle you know babysitting and things like that single dad same thing having to work find you know pay for having their kids being watched and all the while having to buy gas, food. It's tough out there, guys. It's the hardest time in 41 years, okay? It hasn't been like this for 41 years. All right, I'm seeing loneliness. And I'm seeing, you know, a lot of loneliness, okay? And then I'm seeing this person who came in for some of you this is a very giving, loving person. They gave you their cup, and I'm seeing marriage, guys. I'm seeing a lot of happiness and joy. Here's this person coming in with their cup. I'm going to show this to you, okay? And here is the sun, which is happiness, joy, and, you know, great things opening up for you. And here is my commitment card, okay? So that's awesome for you, all right? For those of you that want marriage, I'm not saying you have to get married. Okay, there's always somebody that's going to comment and say something like that, so I try to cover everything. All right, guys, here I'm seeing some of you just had someone come in, but you had to end it, okay? There was, um, there's something going on in the background for some of you at work, okay? Um, yeah, and you got, you caught wind of it, you figured it out. All right, it wasn't good. So I don't know if this was the whole job ended or it's going to end. You were told it's going to end. You were told about a layoff of some sort, guys. All right, these things are going to happen. There are companies laying off, but there's other companies out there that are paying crazy money so they can get people to come in and work, okay? Remember that, all right? You got mental clarity on this work scenario and... um yeah, it's, it's, it's not a good scenario, okay? But I'm still seeing this romantic partner rushing in with this sword. And this is what I saw in the last reading as well. Okay, guys, I'm seeing money and more money, okay? You guys are going to be receiving money. I feel like this is happening within a few days, all right? Um, you guys are going to be receiving, this isn't the money I talk about. This is some kind of... I don't know, a gift or somebody's going to come in and help you guys. Some of you that are, you know, at your wits end and really need money. Uh, somebody's going to loan you some money or you're going to go in your mailbox and find a check. Um, something's coming in for you, okay, that's to hold you over. It's going to, it's going to, you know, bind you over for a little while, not long, okay. And then I'm um, seeing defensiveness here and, um, some people, something regarding a child or children, and these children are your everything, okay? They're your everything. So you're like mama bears and daddy bears out there ready to kill somebody who messes with your kids, okay? Something to do with some regret and a broken heart possibly with a child or children. 
Um, I don't know what you guys are going through with that, but sending love and light. All right. And I'm seeing uh, sadness with this broken heart and the monies are being juggled. Okay. There's confusion. All right. And you're just looking at this whole situation right now saying, oh my God, what am I going to do? All right. And here, more sneakiness. Okay. Causing this great burden for you. Um, you know, you're totally disappointed. You're pissed off. You're super angry. You're going through it. Okay. They want you to use your intuition guys and love yourself. Keep nurturing yourself. Do the things that make you feel pampered and good. Okay. Keep doing those things. If you don't have the money, do the simple things around the house. Do the exercises I tell you to do that will raise your vibration and help you manifest. Just set your intention. I'm making this cup of coffee to love and nurture myself. I'm running this bath to, you know, nurture myself. I'm lighting this candle to, you know, love myself, nurture myself. It doesn't matter what you do. Keep doing that and saying that and things are going to change for you exponentially. All right. I'm seeing this bad ending for some of you and this conflict over here. Okay. I feel like somebody's fighting over a guy. All right. There's maybe two sisters or two women fighting over the same guy. Okay. Um, yeah. And you know, they're like, yeah, I guess they're both really happy about this guy, okay? All the while, Spirit's saying, this offer is too small for either one of you, okay? All right, I've had... <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm done. Spirit is saying that that should be ended, okay? The whole, the whole idea that this person is some special, magical, wonderful person, that should be ended because they're not, okay? Um, you guys... Don't lose a friendship or a sisterhood over someone who isn't worthy, okay? No one, no one's worthy of a breaking up sisters or best friends or anything like that, okay? Or brothers for that matter, okay? This could be for my, my, my masculines or my feminines. And here I'm seeing it will, it will balance out. You are going to balance this out, okay? You're going to balance it out. But in the meantime, this person that you're fighting over is toxic. Okay, this person is toxic, guys. They might not be showing it when you first meet people. They're on their best behavior, but this person's going to turn out to be toxic, okay? And you will be very upset. You're going to be very upset if you, either one of you, um, end up with this person, okay? Especially because I'm picking up on your personality and you don't like confrontation normally, um, you're very laid back. You let, you know, you don't sweat the small stuff. And I am seeing a, a partner coming in for one of you or both of you. And the Ace of Wands is also coming in saying that this partner is the one. This part, this new person coming in, not the one you're fighting over is the one. Okay. Um, someone's ignoring the sword tongue. And that makes me deliriously happy. Okay. They're connecting to spirit. They're praying and they're, you know, being really strong with their finances. They're muddling through and they're keeping their chin up. They're connecting to spirit. And that, that is so important because that will make you feel stronger and help you, you know, with their support, get through this guys. Okay. Okay. Because you're going to feel the support and things are going to start happening for the better. All right. Here someone's making a choice. Um, with this, this new cycle coming in, someone is sitting on the fence, not making a decision about something. Okay. They should be making a choice on something and they're not making a decision. All right. And, and I feel like it's, it's regarding this person who is like a father figure. It could be your father. It could be your stepfather. It could be someone that you look up to as a father figure. Okay. Who has brought, brought a lot of happiness into your life. Okay. And you have to make some kind of decision on this person. All right. And then they're saying you have like a, a ton of opportunity guys that you don't know. It's just sitting there. It's just sitting there waiting for you. Whatever you want, you can go get it. You can manifest it. And you don't know how much happiness is sitting there because all these different things that will make you happy that you don't know you have access to, but you do. So go get it, guys. 
go get it. And that is the reading. I hope you guys have an excellent day. Later.